Hey, what's going on YouTube fam? Mark here and I want to do a quick and fast two minute tutorial on how to get your filter bars back in the event that you lost them in Lightroom. So every once in a while I'll find myself where I can't find my filter bars down here. Uh, sometimes they just disappear and I just don't know where they go. Uh, but one of the two ways that you can get it back or you can do a workaround is if you click filter, it'll bring those all the way back out through your flagged, uh, the filter based on any edit status, your rating, and also your colors right here. So if you in the event that you do lose that, simply click the filter button right there. And if you want another alternate workaround to get into your sorting, you can come up and press the forward slash uh, on the keyboard when you're in library mode only. So in library mode, uh, you can come up and press that forward slash and it's going to bring down a sorting bar just like that. And then you can get to attributes and sort it by red, sort it by yellow, or red and yellow. So that's going to get you that way down here. So it's the same exact buttons down here. And if you are using UI scaling, it is a little bit easier to find them up here than it is down here. Uh, just simple fact that these get really tiny on there. So I hope you guys appreciate this two minute tutorial. And if you stick around for a quick bonus, I'm going to show you guys how to find photos in your library by all kinds of different attributes. So if you press the control F on your keyboard, or if you go into library and then find, what you're going to do is you're going to find a drop down box in here in the metadata and then you can come in and sort by all kinds of different things dates file names keywords one of the one particular ones that i love to sort by is my uh, focal length because generally what i'll do is i'll find my uh, particular shots that i did with a 200 millimeter f2 that i have one of my favorite lenses and i'll sort it by that so again guys thanks for liking subscribing thanks for commenting thanks for hitting that bell button and if you appreciate this tutorial Check back next time for another one, another two-minute tutorial in just a few days. Thanks a lot.